Greetings. This is General of the Armies, Vincent Diaz Jr. This is a communique for Vladimir Putin. Attention to all world leaders. CC all stakeholders. Topic is further terms over my one quarantine I need. There has been clear desire to try to make it with me the way this is actually a way of making it, the way there's basically no way to make it without I and who I can choose to try to make it this way with. Proving it, anyone can make it. And these systems they've only proven can never be used to make it through this pandemic. All right. So the facility is um, the Holiday Inn attached to the FEMA building. That's the facility I'm calling. Holiday Inn and the FEMA building. The whole, the whole there's a square complex. And then there's a square block there with resources. Uh, maybe, maybe not. We'll need the whole square block, uh, but probably just holding to that complex. And um, I'll have to probably go in and out, even though I like to lock down for good. So I have to work all the jobs, for sure. And no one can be allowed to work any jobs whatsoever, basically. At least within my ecosystem. Like a monopoly, at least. Although I don't know about totally holding the infrastructure and the utilities, which I like to just bypass as best I can. My plan is, um, if everybody was just dead by the end of this, I've seen the automation systems here, the way the monsters are always in control, like at Starbucks, so like emergency hiring, just apply online. And you know, anyone who knows how to get a job, but no one who doesn't should ever. You know, if everyone is dead, I figure I could go to the day's end over there, and it would all be all set. So I could just, you know, apply and get hired to get there, so it could run, so I could use it. Could be mine, sort of. It would be my house to get mail at. I'm working. Then I would um, try to use the same system, where I'd be the only one working the postal system at the post office. And with my next job, I should be able to get it with everyone dead. And the system's automated, just needing a hire of any sort of the species. Which might be like this logic they're explaining why we have the worst case scenario ever with their, their, with their hires. Working the post office, and you know, I'm not going to talk about my full work yet. I would need um, redundancy in Amazon. I need, I need Amazon. And then Amazon is all mine to run alone. The post office is mine to run alone. Days in and FEMA building are mine to run alone. The whole block is mine to run alone. They're still alive. They have to be held off to a square mile at least. Uh, sort of. Those who I can choose to try to make it with, who have clearly chosen my path of this loving life and, and, and left me th this path to keep trying to save them. Basically, white girls who don't want to be with their families under eight years old uh, of, of the of the terms already put out um, so my redundancy system through Amazon is an Amazon counter and lockers at the days in and the rest of the facilities around the block and then I have a few more chunks I probably need the railroads maybe I don't need the railroads I'm trying to avoid the infrastructure I was thinking maybe I can't automate the postal services planes. I don't really want to have to travel cross country. Then I need to run Schwann's and I need to run Omaha Steaks uh, to get mail delivery hammered out and automated to get food supplies. But I also have to hold Walmart. I have to hold all the Walmarts, but at least um, the, probably the two in town here, the two in D.C., maybe just one with a set where I'm also the only worker of all the Walmart and having Walmart web delivery at a Walmart um, so I can run a Walmart for, for local groceries and have all the Walmart online delivered there for a third redundancy step uh, with the Amazon step not chunking and then I need some supplies that are tough I probably need I have an Oregon hemp supplier I'm not sure what I'm doing with that if I have to like I need all the hemp in Oregon and all the, all the marijuana in Oregon I need to re run the whole marijuana industry in Oregon I want them all dead and gone there now for how they have uh, to run through the mail. That'll be my system to retreat. And then I need to run the whole marijuana industry in California. And uh, I probably need a Colorado link where I own the Colorado airport, the special Denver airport with the canvas tops. 
and I need to run the whole marijuana industry in Colorado and all the beer industries in Colorado. And then maybe there's a sustainable situation. This is sort of what I've been planning. And I have all the skills and knowledge, except how to kill all the humans off, to achieve full automation all these systems. I just don't want to travel. I want the rail yards. I want all my rail, rail lines back, all my rail cars. I probably would never want to drive again. Probably never want to be on the road again. But I was thinking I can automate my mail trucks to get on the trains, to get off with the fully automated, with redundancy and fully automated planes of, of the Postal Service, uh, holding the rail line from here uh, across the coast to California uh, by way of um, Colorado with the stretch goal of having that Oregon stretch goal as a hub somehow from there. Uh, maybe the trucks can get on the planes, maybe not. Maybe something smaller, probably not a car. Maybe the planes can get on the trains. Maybe the planes can take off from the trains, not likely. The trains ain't getting on anything but the rails. Uh, let's see, I need a few more things. Then I need what I'm getting through the mail. I need Guitar Center. I need to run all of Guitar Center. You know, the sad fact is, I've, I've been working with all these places because of the way they've treated me in business. They all owe me so much restitution, I already own them, by all law. They just won't pay the restitution until I kill all the humans in the way. It's like all of them. Just every every life form that's ever supported this, but not just killing them all at all times. Yeah, I basically have been. But, but they're not the same as me. Maybe I need some glass and some bottling. Maybe I can run it all in the, in the Colorado industry. With, with, the, with the full control of the Colorado mar marijuana industry and, and bottling and brewing industry, I wonder if I can make all those marijuana products like I've had in the, in the California industry. Now I'm thinking about all my packaging and stuff. You know, I need all that, and I'll run it all alone, and I'll automate it all. And then I'll have all, all the distribution automated, and I hope there's no, no maintenance left, and then I can lock down at the day's end. Sort of anything, you know, just, just local. Hopefully, you know, being able to raise just all, all the, all the, you know, all the most beautiful eight-year-old or under white girls, properly, congenially, never wanting to be with their family ever in all ways that means. If that species should ever stand a chance, uh, I think this is about everything. Uh, and then there's all these cats and dogs I've trained to speak English. Um, with, with the families, they, they've sort of um, taken names with, never me. Maybe we can bring them in. I'm not sure how much more work there is. Because I, I have the food designed, so I can probably not have to have even special animal food. It's just a matter of making all this food. And then, and then, and then my, my, I need to be cooking this food. I need to do all the work of all the products and all the, all the lines. But I've already talked about the stuff I need. Uh, These are the basic terms of actual survival conditions. Of survivors surviving, survivably. My terms, surviving with survivors that want to survive, surviving and survivability. There's not much more. Electronics and such. Maybe I can hold that in California as well.